Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Vancouver Island Bushcraft. Great news. I passed the 200 subscriber mark yesterday. I think I'm at 209, which is great. Thanks to my beautiful wife, Bridget. She put a little shout out on her Facebook as a birthday wish to get over 200 subscribers and a lot of her friends subscribe. So those of you who subscribed and are watching this, thank you so much. And um, I have an interesting little video. Um, it's early in the morning. It's uh, it's about 8.30 or so, and I'm down in the office, and um, I'm always looking, of course, to um, have a better situation when I'm out and trying to light a fire. So what I decided to do, and I'm not sure if this is wise or not, I decided to mix um, some potassium nitrate and icing sugar and some fatwood um, shavings. Uh, like uh, whenever I cut fatwood, I always get uh, sawdust, so those that sawdust is in there, and there's actually a container that has potassium nitrate and icing sugar and um, fatwood. So what I did was I put it in here and added water and made a paste. And here is a sample of the paste. And then I put these in, this is jute twine, and soaked it all in there and then let it dry overnight. And then with this one here, I just did one because I don't know if it's going to work. Um, I dipped it in wax. So let's see how well this lights. Okay, let's give this a shot. I'm just going to use a lighter just for sake of um, quick demonstration. Okay, you guys ready for this? Potassium nitrate, icing sugar, fatwood, jute twine, and wax. Let's see. So it's burning very well so far. You got about a six, seven inch flame. It's not curling up too quickly. That would be the potassium nitrate and icing sugar going off. I should probably move this bundle. This is going quite a long time, isn't it, guys? Okay, we're about a quarter of the way there. I'm curious what's going to happen when it hits this mass right here. It's a little bit extra um, potassium nitrate and uh, fatwood. So these can easily just be put in your pocket. You can just actually fold it up and put it in your pocket. This is lasting an amazing amount of time. Wow. I'm impressed. I think I'm going to do the rest of these. I'm going to put it down and see how well it lights. It stays lit flat against something. Because that's always a good test because lots of times if, um, these things will go out if they can't light all the way around. Well, that's, that's really, I think this would be really good, you know, in wet conditions to see, um, to, to get to light small twigs and that kind of stuff because it's staying lit a very long time. Not sure how wise it is to light potassium nitrate in my house, but it doesn't explode, it just burns quickly. Well, guys, I think that's a successful test on these little these little guys here. These ones don't have um, the wax on them yet. Yeah, that's burning really well. Maybe a little too well. <laughs> Perfect. So there we go. So I'm going to make a bunch of these um, and have them in my kit. They don't weigh anything. And if I need to start a fire really quickly, I can do that.
Alright, thank you for watching Vancouver Island Bushcraft, and if you like this video, please subscribe.